guys, so today I am doing a look on how to bronze the skin for fair girls. So I found um, I was having a really hard time doing a bronzing look for my face. So I came up with this little system. I hope you enjoy. So this is the finished look. At the end of the video, I'm like, oh, I'm going to come back and show you. So this is actually me coming back and show you. So capture this. And then that is what you'll see at the end. So I hope that you enjoy. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is start with Tarte Smooth Operator Amazonian Clay Illuminating Serum. Now I just have a little sample guy of this, um, but I've been using it lately and I really, really like it. So I'm just putting that all over my face. Obviously I've already done my skincare. I have my um, sunscreen on and everything. So this is really shiny, I'm sure you can tell. Um, so it's definitely not something that I personally would or could just put on and leave. They're like, oh yeah, you can just slap this on and leave it. And I was like, um, it's a little shiny for me. Um, so then I have just been wearing powder as of late because that's all I need. So to get that really nice glowing complexion, you can't go too orangey bronzy. Um, when you're doing it because otherwise you're gonna get too much orange going on and with a fair complexion it just doesn't look good so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with a powder that's one shade darker than the powder that I normally use so I'm using the mineralized skin finish in medium plus which is quite a bit darker than my skin tone and I'm just taking um, my MAC brush like this and I'm putting this on the center of my face so I'm not going out to the outside edges, and you can see this tones down the shine considerably. So I'm just putting it right in the center of my face. Now this gives me that warmth in the center of my face, but it's not going to give me a line here. So I'm just buffing that in everywhere. So then the next step that I'm going to do is I'm going to take my color, and that's light in the Mineralized Skin Finish, and I'm going to put this on the outer edges of my face. All I am doing is just really buffing that powder into the skin because you want it to look really natural. So then I'm going to go in with my bronzer. So this is Park Avenue Princess Bronzer from Tarte. Again, I just got like a little trial one. It just looks like this. So it's a really it's got shimmer to it, it's not the matte one, but it's a nice color for me. It's a little bit lighter than some bronzers, which is nice. So I'm using a more sculpted brush that has a little bit more um, to it than just like a big bronzer brush because I want to put the bronzer in really specific places. So I'm going to load up my brush with some bronzer and I'm going to start back here with my bronzer and I'm actually just pushing it into the hairline and up. And then right onto the forehead, but really subtly. And I don't want to bring the bronzer too far down because that can make fair girls look too orange right in here. Not a good look for us. So starting here and pushing it back into the hairline. So instead of powdering, I'm actually just pressing the bronzer into the skin. And I'm using it above the contour line, so I'm not contouring with my bronzer. I'm actually creating a glow effect rather than a sculpted effect. Now, the biggest thing when you're doing bronzing is that you can come off a little bit too orange. So what I decided to do was take a pink blush on a smaller blush brush. So this one is from MAC. I don't know what the number is, but it's just a little bitty. And I'm taking the color Sin, which is this one here. Sorry if I'm blinding you with the mirror. This one. Um, and I'm pressing that one right up here. Right on almost where you'd put your highlight. And this just gives it a little bit of pinky peach you're still bronzed, you're still glowing, but it's less orange, which is what we want to shy away from. 
awesome. So now we've got the basics, we want to give us the glow. So I'm using Sunbeam from Benefit. All I'm doing is taking a little bit, well, quite a bit actually, because I like a lot of this stuff. It's my new favorite product. Um, putting it on my hands, and then I'm scooping it between my fingers, and then I'm just going to pat it on the high points of the cheeks, really, really lightly, just little taps. Now, if you're getting, like, fingerprints, that's okay, because you're going to just keep patting and blending. Patting and blending. And I'm bringing this right in, because I really want to glow on the cheek. You can put it up into the brow, depending on the eye that you're doing. And just keep patting it until it's all blended in. And that's it. That's all there is to a bronzy, glowy look for a fair person. So you want to use bronzers that are a little bit less pigmented, and you don't want to bring them so far in, and you don't want to use them as a contour, because that's when you can get that kind of weird, clowny, orangey look. And add a pop of color, whether it's peach or pink. I like pink because it takes away from that oranginess, but you could use a peach blush if you wanted to as well. So that's it. I will come back and show you the finished look so you can see my full summer bronze.